Hello everyone, welcome to provide a solution given this nice algebra problem. So if it is your first time you come across my videos, please like this video and subscribe to my channel. Now solution, we have that square root of x plus x, this is equal to, to 2, okay? So this is our problem, square root of x plus x is equal to 2. So the first thing to do here, let's make square root of x the subject of the formula so that we'll have square root of x, we take x on the right hand side, we'll have to subtract x. The next step is to square both sides. Let's square both sides, okay? So that now we simplify here, remove the eliminate the square root sign. So this is the same thing as 2 minus x, okay? This is 2 minus x. So, if we expand this equation, this is the same thing as 2 multiply 2 minus x, subtract x, multiply 2, subtract x. So here, x is equal to 2 times 2, which is 4, subtract 2 times minus 2 minus x, that is negative 2x, subtract negative x times 2, negative 2x, negative x times negative x, this is plus x to power 2. Now from here, let's correct the right terms, so this is x is equal to 4, subtract negative 2x minus 2x, this is minus 4x plus x to power 2. Now let's rearrange this equation. We'll have x squared subtract 4x plus 4. We take x on the right hand side, so this is minus x. This is equal to 0. Okay. Now we have x squared subtract negative 4x subtract x. This is minus 5x plus 4. This is equal to to zero. Now here, this is a quadratic equation of the form ax squared plus bx plus c. This is equal to, to zero. Now here, we have a equal to one, b equal to negative five, and c equal to four. Now, this quadratic equation, we can solve this by this one can be solved easily through um, factorization, okay? So here, we have the product, okay? And the sum rule, okay? So we need to identify two factors. If you multiply those two factors, you should get the product of, this is 1 times 4, which is actually 4, product of 4, and the sum of negative 5, okay? So those two numbers, essentially, those two numbers, these two numbers are negative 4 and negative 1. So you are saying that these two numbers, these two numbers, we have negative 4 and negative 1. Okay, so if you say negative 1 times neg negative 4 times negative 1, this is 4. Negative 4 plus minus 1, this is negative 5. Let's substitute this. So we'll have x to power 2, subtract 4x, subtract x, plus 4. This is equal to, to 0. So x squared minus 4x is common here. So we factor out x. So this is x subtract 4, subtract 1, okay? Then this is x plus 4, so this is x minus 4. 4, this is equal to, to 0. So here we have x subtract 1 and x subtract 4, this is equal to, to 0. So in this case we have two, two parts here, x minus 1 is equal to 0. We have two values of x and x minus 4 is equal to 0. So this means that x1, this is equal to 1 and x2 here, this is equal to 4. So we have two values of x, 1 and 4. 
So let's check, let's verify if these two values of x actually satisfies the equation, okay? Let's check quickly. So let's verify that x1, which is equal to 1, and x2, which is equal to 4, actually satisfies the equation. Now, if you recall, we end that the square root of x plus x, this should give us a value of 2. So let's start with x1, which is 1. So this is square root of 1 plus 1. This is equal to, to 2. So square root of 1, this is basically 1. 1 plus 1, this is equal to, to 2. 1 plus 1, this is 2. Okay. So the left hand side is equal to the right hand side. Okay. So that means that x1 satisfies the equation. Let's check x2, which is equal to 4. Now we'll have square root of 4 plus 4. This should give us a value of 2. Now square root of 4, this is 2 plus 4. <coughs> this should give us a value of 2. 2 plus 4, this is 6, which is not equal to, to 2. Okay? So that means that x2, which is equal to 4, this one does not satisfy the equation. Does not satisfy the equation. That means that we only have one solution, which is x1 equal to 1. This is the only solution to this problem. So thank you for watching. Kindly follow the steps, like this video, and subscribe, my good people. Subscribe. Thank you. Thank you.